of Joey Logano. And Logano will be on the outside in the 12. Cole Custer on the inside. And we're racing from Chicago Lair. Look at the run Cole Custer has on the inside, but right away he has to check up a bit and Joey Logano surging ahead on the outside. I think Cole Custer might have gotten to the apron just a little bit down there in turn one and two had to check up just somewhat, but fell in line here in second. And that Christopher Bell with that strong move, he's gotten himself to fourth already. First lap led in 2019 in the Xfinity Series for Joey. Our guy gets down in the corner yeah. and, and gets over that bump, gets up, gets the back of the car upset. We saw it in the pre-race, get loose over that bump. Trying to save it, trying to keep that splitter out of the grass. He does a great job, never really locks up this set of tires. I don't know how badly they'll be damaged, but certainly no good now. Got to put on stickers. Two, three, and four, and he will see the green and white checkered flag. Cole Custer's sixth stage win of 2019, and that's another playoff point. Third caution of the day. One of them was for the end of stage one. The other two have been for incidents. This one was Ryan Sieg in the 39. See, didn't quite spin out a car. Lost control. I think NASCAR thought he was going to spin out. I thought he was going to spin out. Kept rolling. So now, guys, it's a big decision as we see another replay of Ryan C. right, with closing in on 10 to go. You're probably going to have 8 to go when you restart this thing. Do you burn a set of tires for a better finish in the stage? I take a look at what new tires will do. Can't go below that white line until after you cross the start finish line. So you see that double zero. Custer went down there as soon as he could. There were three wide and cars falling back quickly as the double zero Cole Custer coming out of two has already made it up into the top five. That's so much fun. Man, when you got new tires, it's Christopher Bell trying to take this stage win away. The 12 laid it on his right rear quarter panel trying to pull that air off of him. How far can Cole Custer go? Right now, back to the apron and the double zero. The fight for the lead up front. Logano has it right now. Bell trying to take it away. Almost four wide there. Reddit going into turn turn one there. It's one set of new tires. Get by all guy first. Briscoe's there. <laughs> stuck behind him. Jones is stuck behind him. Just nowhere to go. They're three wide with older tires. But where are you going to go? Amanda Jones trying to make it four wide. Do you have enough time? Only five laps. Under five laps to go. It'll be four to go when they cross the stripe here. Look at Reddit being so defensive of that. That position he took on Noah Gregson. Sendrick. That was awesome. Look at this. Side drafting, pulling back that double zero of Cole Custer. But here comes Custer and Brandon Jones. On the left side of the screen, Joey Logano is going to end up winning stage two. Christopher Bell will finish second. Checker this time. That is. Oh, oh, we got a center. And spinning right in front Briscoe. of the field as they're coming back here. Chase Briscoe trying to come across. He locks the tires up and stops before. He gets to the finish line. Steve Latart threw his pin down. You know why? Because that's a set of tires. It's on the top, really loose. You saw him wiggling really early in the corner. Good to stay out of the grass. We've got to be quick, though. We're all we can't pass cars with no tires on. Wild ride, Chase Briscoe. Stayed out. Oh, and he got a handful there. Got very Allgaier loose, maybe wall. even into the wall. Allgaier gets into the wall. Hard. He's got a he's got a right front tire down too. He's gonna have a hard time not staying. Not he's gonna hit the fence down here if he's not careful. Right front damage. And it looked as though Jeffrey Earnhardt got loose coming up the racetrack, and then Allgaier got into the wall just behind him. And we stay green. Watch the 81 come up the track here. Yeah, it's, right there, he's in trouble. Algar trying to get on the outside of him. And as the 12 goes by the 81, that 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 sweeps the 60 laps as the 15 got the wall, and we have a caution. We turn the right side. Is this an ideal situation for Annette and Gregson? Couldn't be better timing. Homestead, Miami. 
but he beat Kyle Busch when he did it. Now he comes to Chicagoland, a racetrack where everyone is looking at it and saying, this is a racetrack like Homestead, Miami, as we're in the Credit One Bank, one lap to go. The final lap here at Chicagoland. But this is another racetrack that almost mimics or mirrors what they're going to have to race for a championship. Cole Custer has put on a dominant performance as he has led 150 laps and about to lead the most important one, the last one, coming out of turn four. And Cole Custer is going to win at Chicagoland. Checkers. Good job, buddy. Good job. Watch it, This battle for fifth. Mm. Brandon Jones, Austin Sindrick, and Jones is going to get the nod there for fifth. Awesome car, don't know how you can get any better. That's got to sound really good from driver to crew chief. We saw Cole Custer spraying water on his face earlier. Well, he cooled off enough. And Cole Custer just took it to the Cup champion, Joey Logano. So not only did he beat his the guys he thinks he's going to have to beat to win this championship, he also beat the Cup champion. Yeah, one of the best.